Howdy. Fine morning today. Hey, friend. Back to work. Fine morning. Hire a whole new crew. Howdy, fellas. Don't you cause no more trouble around here, you hear? Good morning. Good morning, Hello. partner. Good morning, mister. Sir, partner. good morning. Good morning to you. How do you do, sir? Forgive me. Glad you dropped in. I've got that, uh, information you asked for. Um, I need something more specific this time. A wagon full of moonshine. Well, you might just be in luck. I knew I picked the right feather to speak to. Hey, mister. Hello. Howdy. How do you do? Hello, gentlemen. Well, hello there. Hello there. Hello there. Morning, Ted. Hey there. Morning, partner. How's it going? I'm still standing.
you home.
You're a wonderful man! Wonderful! <laughs> you got my money? Uh, it's, it's for a very good cause. Uh, my name is Professor Andrew Bell III. Perhaps you've heard of me. <laughs> Can't say that I have. Oh, I'm an inventor. Uh, maybe you've read about me. <laughs> uh, I don't read much. Oh, oh, well, that's too bad. Oh, yes. <laughs> you got my money? <clears throat> oh, well, it, it is the most wonderful invention, friend. Oh, you, sir, have done a great deal. All deed. I've done is get some creep a lot of drink. <laughs> Creepers. Excellent. No, nonsense. Now, you've helped me develop the most humane machine imaginable. A way to induce calmness to our most troubled souls. A way to end the barbarity of a public hanging. Oh, so, so humane. What are you talking about? The electric chair. What? See, it's a chair full of electricity. It's quite fascinating. It calmly and peacefully dispatches the sinners uh, to face judgment. Yes, judgment. Yeah. Where is it? Well, it's in my laboratory. The next thing I need is a, a demonstration, a public one. Huh. Uh, do you know the police chief? Hmm? As well as anyone. Oh, wonderful. Perhaps you can encourage him to let me demonstrate the chair. It will help bring this town into the next century. Yes, could you do that? Hmm? Hello, excellent, excellent. Oh, this wonderful methanol. Hey, partner. Hello, mister. Hello. Hey there. How are you, ma'am? Still, girl. So, welcome to our humble police house. I can't possibly help you if you don't tell me what you need. <clears throat> Chief, I'm representing the inventor of a humane execution machine, an electric chair, and he, uh, he wants to demonstrate his invention here. Ah, I'm familiar with the man and his work. Tell you what, I'll give you a permit, but it's going to cost you $100 in fees. Hey, look, this will save you money in the long run, and uh, it'll save the condemned a whole lot of pain. That remains to be seen, but I'll give you a permit for 50. Okay, well, the price is fair, here you go. And here, sir, is your permit. Appending the usual formalities, of course, such as uh, 
Finding a suitable candidate for humane dispatchment? I'll tell that to the professor. Good luck. Hello, mister. Hello. Hello, Professor... Professor... Andrew Bell the Third. That's it. So, the Chief says you can test out your machine, oh. pending the usual formalities. And what are they? Uh, finding a suitable, uh, subject. Ah, funny you should mention. This fella here, he seems sturdy enough, and he's guilty as sin. Wilson J. McDaniels. Wanted for murder, bigamy, and... Immoral animal husbandry. What's that? The mind shudders. Uh, here, find him for me and help me put him out of his misery. coming together wonderfully. The final piece of the puzzle. Folks, hello, Easy. boy. Look at this. Y'all must be with the circus. 
Let's be some sense into it. Sogni d'oro! Erbo! Hey, mister. Yep. It's all good. Calm down. You look like hey, a damn partner. fool. Hey, you know if any Pinkertons have been seen around here? Hi there, mister. Happy to assist you in a moment. Hello, how can traveling mercies to you? <laughs> 